Hello, I'm Dudley Thompson and welcome to our coverage of the Hagley Park Curb Project here and the China Harbour has, has placed a new sign here if you're coming down by Maho Drive White Wing you can turn with arrow and access Spanish Town Road and to Marcus Garvey Drive to White Wing and then you go left and then the first right to access Spanish Town Road and it rained a short while ago you want to see now the impact the rain is having on the work side here at 3 miles and here just across from for the supplies I can see pedestrians have to be navigating carefully not to walk into muddy here along the work side here this is after heavy rain that fell about half an hour ago pedestrians and also motorists here along the roadway here along well some Hagley Park Road heading into White Wing Maho Drive and the workers will be coming here to work tomorrow morning and to the children going to school will be a challenge to cross the heavy mud right here and you can see the work site here is under some water here up by the ramp and you can see the closer look pool of water here on the ramp by Hagley Park Road here and also the walkway for students go to school tomorrow morning it, it, they, make, they might cut access right here tomorrow morning because it's thick mud and heavy water here where I, I walk in mud here right here at Coburn Garden Primer and Junior High for the students they have to walk to go to school tomorrow morning here is impossible as you can see so maybe able to navigate this little stretch here and it could be a challenge for students coming here to school tomorrow morning you're seeing the dumper there at a stop to stop dumping the dirt here it was asked to stop, not sure why and here at the ramp and across here from the Corbin Gun Primary and Junior High water is running here this and since the rain the water is running here is going here beside the ramp it will be a minor test for the newly constructed drainage and despite the rain we are now seeing another underground leak here and it is right beside the post office at the checkpoint here at Olympic and the three miles another underground leak here on the work site but they're wondering where will this underground leak stop here on the site another one we saw five last week and repaired on two and now there's another underground leak here just beside the post office here on the work site just, just beside the post office here and we're seeing there they are throwing a mall on the surface here because of the heavy rains to prevent the mud along here and they're throwing mall here along in front of the NCB bank and what was once the bus stop here and on the 4 T beam here just a T beam across from the post office the 4 time color brother or beam we see one T beam is currently on and the other T beam is on its biggest way across here the second T beam is now in flight to make two right here and very soon very soon this section has to be closed off to all vehicular traffic under here that was once a 
makeshift taxi stand and I think it can be no more because above the T beams are coming across and to prevent any further injury to a person or vehicle they have to make sure that no pedestrian or vehicle is under here and again the TV is coming across and these things are heavy 40 meters in length and weigh over 140 tons and this one is coming coming across here the second T beam and the next when this is finished they will now go over to the abutment right in front of the post office again this will complete this work on the bridge so the TV is just let me say basically just almost there and you can see it's moving it's just about there it was like illegal copyright it is totally legal <laughs> 100% legal, I may add. And the T beam is now there. And the back of the T beam is now coming down slowly onto the beam here. It's coming down slowly, as you can see. carefully and it is going down very slow and you will soon see the back of the T-beam will rest on this beam here it's coming down very slow it has stopped momentarily and the workers are there beam is coming across slowly so they can rest so they can mesh or they can it goes flat on that uh, black surface there the coil I think it was called is coming across now to the left very very slowly I'm not sure if you can see it and then it will go down still coming across it looks as though it's coming across to the third one here from the left 